Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video and today we're going to be making the sun the mass of one Milky Way. So I've never actually tried this on this yet I don't think. I may have done it way back in when I first started playing over a year ago in this game but I've never put it to one Milky Way. So if you didn't know, yeah, the sun is 0, 0.0, yeah, 0. a lot of zeros, 172 Milky Ways in mass. So yeah, poor little sun here. Yeah, it's very, very small compared to the whole Milky Way, as you can see in the background here. But, yeah, crazy stuff. So, let's give this a try. So, it'll probably be a shorter video than usual, but yeah, I, I'm pretty sure you guys are like the shorter ones, because the shorter they are, the more I can make. So, yeah, it'll be pretty cool. So, today may be a double upload. Uh, uh, maybe. So, anyways, let's get into this. So, one Milky Way. Let's do this. All right. And then let's press it. So, slow down time first. We don't want it to, like, this is going to mess everything up once I do this. So... Let's do this like that and then press that. So now the sun is immediately a black hole and it seems this is in milliseconds. See so if you look carefully, look. We are travelling at 14 seconds right now. Wow, that is amazing. So it's pulling everything towards it. Wow. That is amazing. Just look at this. Wow. I was not expecting it to do that. So it's pretty much the same size as it was before, but its mass is just pulling everything towards it oh my god look jupiter oh jupiter survived wow look at that oh wow it just got shredded though if we have a quick look at jupiter here it actually had a lot of look at all these fragments you can just look carefully here you can't really see it but there's a fragment here so it looks like it got so close to the black hole the black hole started shredding apart and look at its velocity 112 times faster than the speed of light that is crazy so this black hole is launching these planets in milliseconds, as you can see here. So about 200 milliseconds, and they're traveling over the speed of light. That is insane. Even Saturn here, 10.9 um, light speed. Uh, Uranus, 2.61 light speed. Neptune, 1.13. So what about, where's Sedna? That's pretty much the furthest away. Oh, Sedna is about 14% the speed of light. So even Sedna, which is the furthest object away, is still going faster than any man-made object ever made because I'm pretty sure that's faster than Voyager 1 speed and if you look carefully, if we go on um, flashlight mode look at all of these fragments here that have been shredded from Jupiter I'm pretty sure all of these fragments here are from Jupiter that is how much mass poor Jupiter has lost here so if we look, it's lost about full, about no 33% of the mass it originally had so 33% of Jupiter has been torn away and just this is making the computer go slow let's um, delete those objects, there we go Wow. Okay, Saturn's next. And we just lost Saturn. Yep, Saturn. Same thing with Saturn now. 300 times the speed of light. That is insane. Wow. That is just absolutely crazy. Okay, so. Looks like that is that. Okay, we've got Uranus coming next. Increasing in speed again. So, yeah, making the sun the size of a Milky Way is definitely not a good idea. Okay, Uranus as well. Just got shredded up there. So, damn, that's crazy. Wow, Uranus is smaller than Earth now. Look at this. So that little that um, near miss with the sun there has made it. Oh, okay. It just exploded. <laughs> so it's smaller than Earth, and it's no longer a gas giant. That is a rocky planet. Wow. Okay. And apparently it's uh, 1100 or 1100 degrees. It still looks pretty cold, if you ask me. It's still getting smaller. That is crazy. Wow. How close are we to the black hole? Oh, it's in orbit of the black hole. So Uranus is now in orbit, and it's probably getting torn up by the Rouge limit because. Even though it's quite far away, the mass of that black hole is the same as Sagittarius A, which, if you didn't know, is the centre of the Milky Way. So it's um, right here, Sagittarius A. So it's a lot larger than the Sun, but it's the same mass. It's still a mass of one Milky Way, I believe. So, pretty crazy stuff. Wait, I think it's the mass of a Milky Way. Let me just check that. Was it a Milky Way? Let's have a look. Four far okay, it's not a Milky Way then, okay. Oh yeah, because the Milky Way is the entire Milky Way, not just the black hole in the centre. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so poor Uranus is just being completely eliminated. So let's get rid of that, because it would have been torn up by now. So, not good. So, who's next? Okay, looks like Neptune is coming in next. And Neptune is already being torn apart from this distance. So, that is just crazy. Look, even Vesta, or uh, is that an Ovada, a dwarf planet, I believe? Yeah, that's lost some um, mass here. You can see there's a fragment there. Wow, this is crazy. Just look, Neptune there has just been shredded apart. You can see it's losing a lot of mass there. That's pretty crazy. In fact, actually, before we do any more, let's load up a new simulation. So 
so we just let's actually just have the sun and the planets just so it doesn't uh, make the game as slow because the amount of fragments this creates is crazy so let's get the sun again so there we go let's get the whole system wait that won't add, I think that will add the moons in okay we don't want to add the moons in let's turn that off okay so we just want the sun wait okay let me just quickly uh, change that all right couldn't get them to go away all right there we are so we have the sun now let's press add planets to sun so all we have is the set of the eight planets oh and Pluto as well how does it say planets? it says add planets to star not add dwarf planets so what's Pluto doing here well I'm happy it is here it deserves to be a planet in my opinion so right there we are now let's turn it into black holes so we're gonna have to slow down time very very fast here and we're gonna watch every single planet as it gets closer to the sun here so we are going pretty much as slow as the game can go. Like it can't get any slower than this. So let's now turn it into the one Milky Way. So there we go. Let's delete all this and then one Milky Way. So Mercury, look at its velocity here. We're actually going to see what's happening here. So if we go from Mercury, we can see the black hole is invisible. Okay, let's change the background so we can see the black hole a little better. So okay, let's leave it on red. Yeah, that looks good. And let's quickly um. Let's quickly um, do that. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Okay, that's what we want. So now we can see where the black hole is. So, yeah, pretty much exactly the same as the sun used to be in um, size. If you want a quick comparison here, here it is compared to its um, old, or the, here it is compared to the sun as it was as a star, but now it's a black hole. So it's pretty much exactly the same. So now, let's actually speed this up because it doesn't seem like much is happening. Remember, we made it go too slow. So, okay, here we are. So look at its velocity increase. That is crazy. Just because the gravity this thing probably has is absolutely crazy and we literally can't even see anything here it's just darkness all right so let's make sure are they orbiting yeah look they're all going to be pulled in every single object is about to get pulled in so let's um speed up a little more so look how quick it look at this look how fast it's approaching the speed of light that is just crazy that's just insane that and look, it's barely moved from its original position. We are travelling, it's so slow in time, but it's increasing so fast. Like, it's barely moved. Like, if we want a quick look here. Um, so, it's pretty much moved, about 20,000 kilometres it looks like. And it's already at the distance, or the velocity, of three times the speed of light. That is insane. That is just mad. Alright, so let's speed up a little more. So, we're going to get closer to the sun now, so. Right. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, so you want to get it as it gets close to the sun. So we're traveling at 200 times. Oh, we're losing mass. Okay, so we are getting fragments which have been shredded away from poor Mercury here. As the sun just completely shreds it. Oh, Venus as well. Look at Venus. Venus is heating up over there, as we can see. But anyways, Mercury has just smashed into the black hole here. So that's not too good. All right, so Venus, let's check up on you. Oh, so Venus is being shredded up as well. That's not too good. Where's Earth? Can we... Okay, Mars is as well. It looks like Earth is. Wait, where's Earth? Is Earth good? Okay, Earth hasn't changed. Uh, Mars. Okay, Earth and Mars don't look like they've lost any mass yet. Okay, so let's keep an eye on Venus since it's travelling the fastest now. So, these guys are going to slam into the sun. Oh, Venus survived. Okay, so if you just saw that, Venus flew by and luckily did not hit the black hole, which is pretty impressive. So, Venus right now probably isn't doing too good. As you can see, it's losing a lot of... Um, mass here so yeah not good for venus uh, that's a bit of a lighting glitch it looks uh, it just goes from light to dark it should shade down to darkness it's a little peculiar all right so where's earth i think earth is next on the hit list 93 times the speed of light okay okay we've got it right where we want it here so let's slow this down let's hit play and earth is about to just it looks like it's about to go in the black hole here so look at its speed increase almost a thousand times the speed of light and it's gone and all of those little fragments as well have all just been sucked into the black hole. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, so, Venus, are you going to approach back? So, Mars is now the closest to the black hole, so not too good. And it looks like Mars is also losing mass, as we can see here. All of these objects are being um, shredded apart, which isn't too good. So, let's um, speed this up again. Let's make sure we um, keep it slow if you want to see exactly what happens here. So, alright, we're approaching the black hole. Don't really do much of black holes in this game. Yeah, thanks to the guy who recommended this. It's quite a recent comment as well. It was only um, a few hours ago, I believe. Now, as soon as I saw it, I was like, oh, I've got to do this. This is a good idea. All right, so. Okay, Venus is um, getting further away, I think. Let's keep an eye. Yeah, so Venus isn't even coming back. So Jupiter looks like it's next on the hit list. Yep, it is. Okay, so let's delete all those fragments as well. Control D, if you didn't know. Yeah, press the Control D. 
Control key and D at the same time, it removes all those fragments. So that's a pretty good fact if you didn't know. So, Jupiter, how are you doing? Okay, 12 times the speed of light, so not too good. Oh, it's heating up. See, even from this distance. So this is about, um, let's slow it down. So, let's have a look. So even from this distance away, so I think that's three, well, 37 million miles, I think it was. It's at that speed, and it's already heating up. The rouge limit on this black hole is crazy. That's just, damn. All right, so speed this up again, and let's make sure we get it, because the gas chance will be more interesting, since there is more mass for them to lose. So we may get some cool fragments here. So, hey, anyone notice that line there? Look, if you look on the background, see that line going down there? What's all that about? <laughs> yeah, can anyone see that? There's like a line here. That's weird. All right, so, here we are. It's about to go. Oh, we just saw it all go weird there. You just saw it like you could see it was getting bent. It looked like there was two Jupiters for a brief second. All right, so Saturn, you're next. Okay, so Saturn's traveling at 11 times the speed of light right now. And it's definitely going to increase a lot more once we speed this up. So, here we are. Wow, that is just crazy how fast it turns. Oh, Saturn's been shredded. We can look right here. That's not too good. And we're approaching the black hole. And it looks like Saturn escaped, actually. Wow, okay. So Saturn, like Venus, somehow managed to escape. I don't know how that escaped. It looked like it went straight through. Maybe it's because I was playing it too fast, the simulation, but it still got pretty much shredded apart by that, so that's not too good. All right, next up is Uranus. So we're at 10 times the speed of light already, so let's um, get a good view here. So where's Black Hole? You can see it's losing um, bits there. All right, Black Hole, where are you at? There is a Black Hole. Oh, there it is. We can't see it yet. Okay, so let's get a lot closer. Whoa, whoa, okay. What happened there? Okay, slow this down a little more. Ooh, it's definitely getting a lot. Um, let's delete all those particles. All right, so here we are. And Uranus went straight in again. So it's like only Saturn and um, Venus managed to escape here. So who's going to make it next? Pluto or Neptune? Could be close. So they're both traveling about similar speeds. Right. 16.6, 16.8. Okay, they're very, very close in speeds. Okay, that's interesting. So it looks like Neptune, I think, is slightly closer than Pluto is. 32.3. Yeah, yeah, Neptune is faster right now. So Neptune's going to make it first, probably. So, oh, they're very, very close. Okay. So here we are. Neptune is about to um, approach the black hole now. So let's see. Anything going to happen? I'm pretty sure these guys are all going to... Yeah, it looks like... Unless I keep the simulation um, going fast, it looks like they just... Um, get destroyed but if I'm playing it slow they go into the black hole if I'm playing it fast it seems like they somehow managed to escape which doesn't really make much sense oh Pluto did as well see what I was playing it a lot faster there. that's that's very peculiar so yeah I think that's it for this video so basically let's um fast play this let's go into a new simulation here so if you were to put the Sun as a Milky Way to conclude the whole solar system probably would not exist anymore um, did they just eat up the whole solar system? What what happened there? Play. Is that it? Oh, it made the, the sun bigger as well. Okay, that's strange. Let's try that again. So, oh, um, pause it and now Milky Way. One Milky Way. Oh, let's turn this off. Yes, that's not right. We want it as one, uh, one sun radius, but the massive Milky Way. Game, behave. What's it doing? One, the, the radius of the sun. Oh, I don't know what's going on here. We want to lock it at that size there. But we want to so lock it at that size. Now we want to make it one Milky Way. So here we go. So to conclude, there we go. We're going to play it at like normal speed here. So we hit play. And all of the inner solar system is already gone. Jupiter and Saturn look like they're going in there. So it looks like there we are. Do not make the sun a black hole, because bad things happen, as you can see. So we've already lost the... Oh no, the inner planets are still around. Oh, they just got ejected. Oh yeah, because I was running the simulation fast. So if you play it slow enough, you will see them get destroyed. But if you play it fast, it looks like they will escape. So yeah, that will do it for this video, guys. So hopefully you all enjoyed it. Probably a little shorter than usual, but double upload, right? I'll, I'll do a second episode today or tomorrow, something like that. Hmm, should I do a double upload? Maybe. Just depends how many videos I make tonight, because I'm going to make a few. So, yeah, hopefully you guys all enjoyed, and make sure if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, help us on the journey to 500 subs, because that would be awesome. And many thanks to everyone who's subbed and leaves comments and stuff. And if you guys got another idea for a video, 
leave a comment down below because there's a high chance I'll probably do it unless it's something silly. So, yeah, that's that. But anyways, hope you guys um, all have a good day and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.